Over 500 million people have seen the short video we're talking about. So now I want to start a channel like that, but with the added innovation of employing AI to do things like editing, producing titles, and branding. While browsing mobile shorts, I saw that snippets from podcasts and other channels were trending regularly. Creating a name for the channel is the initial step. As an example, consider this channel which regularly attracts a sizable audience by uploading Joe Rogan videos. I saw that channels like JRE Daily Clips that upload shorts and showcase clips like what I want to do are obtaining excellent results, up to 8 million views. The JRE Shorts channel, which has over 86 million views, has very identical basic language and titles. It's a mind-blowing fact that if you go into your expertise, say, shorts for Cristiano Ronaldo, you can undoubtedly find inspiration in the works of others. The narrative of the shooting of Ronaldo, for instance, has been seen more than 8.3 million times. There is a lot of room for growth here. You can easily make films similar to these and attract a lot of attention to yourself. It's simple, and the speed to which it may be accomplished is surprising. Recently, I went to the ChatGPT platform and asked for 10 ideas for YouTube channel names to use while making parody videos of the Joe Rogan's program. The system has given me a list of potential candidates and I must now choose one. Midjourney, an artificial intelligence program designed for creating visuals, was just what I needed to get me where I needed to go. I was looking for a 4K cartoon version of Joe Rogan in particular. The good news is that halfway during the trip, you get to pick from four different image selections. I went with the one in the lower right corner. Once the profile photo is complete, the following step is to design a banner for the channel. For this, you may use Canva, a free online design tool. Don't overanalyze every step of the design process. The YouTube channel will be finished setting up after the banner has been released. Do you want to gather and modify material using AI with Joe Rogan fans in mind? Opus Pro is a website that features a long film made up of 10 different viral videos. This system takes audio or video, chooses the most interesting parts, and enhances them with captions, emoticons, and facial recognition software. I found videos that may potentially go viral on Joe Rogan's site, so I uploaded them with a single click. Thus, the AI produced the most popular video for me to share. <laughs> no, 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 yeah, we thought it was a complete disaster after the first two days of shooting the fight scenes. We're like, this is gonna suck, we're fucked. We did that of necessity. Or if we take a focused approach as a country, like developing a surge, for instance, the AI successfully recorded all the pauses, inserted the necessary content, and chose the most compelling sections. The score of 99 out of 100 is quite high. I did this several times and now have a YouTube library full of such videos. The sheer number of Joe Rogan videos I own means I've already used up my daily allotment, as you can see. If you want your films to become viral, you need to give them the right titles and use the right hashtags. Opus may help with this process by suggesting suitable titles for each video. Titles like Sabotage Your Child's Success or Secrets of Downtown LA Shocking Reality Revealed are sure to get people's attention. It is crucial that you use these titles in your videos. If you're making a Joe Rogan themed YouTube video but don't know what hashtags to use, you should definitely check with ChatGPT. It is recommended that no more than the first three hashtags be used. One helpful tip is to always put the hashtag shorts first, no matter how many others there are. However, we must not overlook the need of expanding upon the existing material and writing a captivating summary. To do this, just add three to five extra hashtags that are relevant to the content of the video. As an illustration, consider the hashtags. Adding hashtags isn't going to help your post go viral, but it's still a good idea. Better exposure is guaranteed if the description is crafted with SEO best practices in mind. If you want YouTube to show your video to the proper people, you need to include relevant keywords in the description. To save time, just copy the introduction and paste it into your own description. Last but not least, remember to save your work. Every video you post will have the description you provide in the upload settings. 
You may prepare all the relevant information and categorizations and it may help you improve your video description over time. I would want a breakdown of how my new YouTube channel is performing. I made this channel a few days ago and just left to see how it will do. My brand new channel for short videos on YouTube now has a rating of 0.1 out of 10. In addition, I have garnered over 1.5 thousand views which is quite surprising given the very brief length of my movies. Even more impressive is the fact that I haven't edited the video at all and yet managed to get 100 views in just 40 seconds. I've gotten 12 new subscribers and my first 5 films have already been seen more than 3,000 times. One of these videos has suddenly acquired a lot of attention and gone viral. Another video has also done really well, with a lot of people watching it. These findings are quite encouraging, especially considering the novelty of this channel. I'm not saying I've made it big, but if you use the same methods I have, you may attract some readers and start a lively discussion among your followers. If you want to increase your chances of success, you should get started on your own YouTube channel right away before your competition catches on. I hope that all of your future plans go well. If you decide to come back, perhaps you can tell me about your own wildly popular channel. Goodbye.